cancer is a challenge that can be overcome. A virus, but it's not just a physical virus, it's an emotional and mental virus. It is a disease, but very much depend on you that how you take it. In cancer, some cells become abnormal and they have a different genetic content and as a consequence, they grow where they're not supposed to grow. When you tell them to stop growing, they don't stop growing. When you don't tell them to grow, they continue growing. And that is essentially what a cancer is. So in most parts of the body, the cancer actually doesn't do anything. Cancer becomes dangerous when it grows in essential organs. So breast cancer by itself may not be dangerous, but when breast cancer moves to your lungs, which is an essential organ, then the side effects are that you can't live without those essential organs, and that is when um, your body then cannot fight back against that cancer. The whole purpose of Born Beautiful event is to create awareness about cancer, about cancer's cure, prevention, uh, treatments. Um, number two is also to raise funds to support two organisations. That is uh, Sarawak Children Cancer Society and also Cancer Research Malaysia. We ask people to donate to us. It's our responsibility to make sure that um, we select the right NGO to support. And we found that these two NGO, they are really worth supporting because they really have done a lot to support the cancer patient and they also have put in a lot of work um, in research about cancer. So we think that these two organisations are very credible for us to support them. Cancer Research Malaysia was started as a non-profit um, research organisation in the year 2000 by Tan Sri Tunku Ahmad Yahya and Topan Dr Aisha Ong. The vision of Cancer Research Malaysia is a future free of the fear of cancer. We believe that by doing research, we can prevent disease, we can treat disease, so that we are able to build a future where we can conquer cancer eventually. The Sarawak Children's Cancer Society started in 2001 by a group of families with childhood cancer trying to support other families going through the same thing. Because when a child is diagnosed with cancer, the whole family has to go through that cancer process with them. So, Having that um, emotional support, knowing that some other families who have gone through this can really be helpful um, in helping them through the whole process. The whole idea of me uh, being part of the Bald and Beautiful awareness team is to create awareness amongst public that it is very important for people outside or looking in at the cancer patient to feel what they are actually going through because until you can try to put yourself in their shoes it's very difficult to really say you understand how a cancer patient feels. I get the courage to do this mainly from my patients and when I see that my patients lose their hair and they are always saying to me you know I'm so worried I'm losing my hair so this is my way of supporting them and to telling them that it's okay to lose the hair because it's only external appearance. I already entered the second phase. So I hope that this second phase 而且我也發覺到哦,留了這個頭髮過後也是蠻愛美的,所以我要挑戰這個愛美,我要重新學習放下,所以我今天可以感受跟大家一起感受這個把頭髮落光的那種那種感受其實很好。When I watched the video of the kids going through chemotherapy and they had the hair loss, it touched me very deeply. So I thought if I go born and I can raise fund for them, can help them financially and spiritually, why not? Our original goal is to get 400 people to go bold. However, we have more than 600 people signing up. So the biggest challenge is how do we organize an event that is smooth, you know, that has the biggest impact. We have to get enough hairdresser, uh, we have to allocate enough space to do all these things. Right? So to me, I think the biggest challenge now is to um, to have a good event on November 16th.
tahu untuk kesedaran kanser lah uh, so nanti orang lain tengok kalau orang tanya saya boleh explain kat dia orang uh, kenapa saya botakkan kepala just for help cancer Um, I think my biggest satisfaction is not what money can buy. Um, I'm satisfied that uh, because of this event, more and more people get to know about cancer. Uh, in the same time, I can see that many people have personal breakthrough by participating in this event. It's not easy to go for, especially ladies. And yet we have so many ladies. We have learned how to organize such a big event. We have learned that Together, by working together, we can achieve a lot more. Hopefully, we can have a much bigger impact, uh, can help more people, and also a lot more people to know about cancer. <laughs>